Welcome to Solvetic, your channel to always learn technology easily. Below in the description, you will find useful links and commands we used in this video. Today in Solvetic, we will see how to fix the NTS file system error in Windows 11 with different solutions. Chapter 1. Enter Safe Mode Windows 11. To start, you will open the Start menu and you will go to Settings. There in System, you will click on Recovery. Now you are going to click on the Restart Now button. Confirm this process for Windows 11 to restart in advanced mode. In this section you will click on Troubleshoot, then you will click on Advanced Options. After this click on Startup Settings. Now you're going to click on Restart. When Windows is restarted on your keyboard press the EFE4 key to start safe mode. Log in and check that everything is working correctly. Finally, you are going to restart Windows to access the normal mode of use. Chapter 2 Configure Event Viewer Windows 11. To start, you will right click on the Start menu and there click on the Event Viewer. In the Event Viewer window that opens, you'll click Windows Logs. Now click on System. Wait for all events to load. There you can sort the events to detect those that have error and check if they are associated with NTFS. If so, when selecting an event you can see all the details of this error. Chapter 3. Use Windows 11 Memory Diagnostics. To be able to use this diagnosis, search for the word diagnosis. In the displayed results, click Windows Memory Diagnostics. Now in the pop-up window displayed, we click on the option Restart Now and check if there are problems. The system will reboot. There we just have to wait for the memory analysis to be completed. Hey, remember to subscribe Solvetic channel. When the scan is complete, the system will be restarted. We look forward to the session starting. Chapter 4. Free up space Windows 11. To begin with, let's search for the word disk in the search engine. We must click on disk cleanup. You're going to select Drive C, wait for all items to load. There you will click on the Clean System Files button, again wait for the items to load. You will activate the boxes that will be deleted. When you click OK, you will need to confirm the deletion. You should expect it to end.
Chapter 5, Validate Windows 11 Drivers To make use of this tool in the home search engine, you will enter the word verifier.x. You will click on the command, accept system permissions. In the pop-up window you see, select the Create Standard Configuration box. Then you will check the automatically select all drivers installed on this computer box. At the end you can see that we must restart the system. Let's restart Windows 11 to apply these changes. Chapter 6, Reset Windows, 11. If you want to reset the computer you will open the Start menu and click on Settings. In System you are going to click on the option called Recovery. Now you are going to click on the Reset the Computer button. It's time to define whether or not you leave your files. Then select the type of installation to use. After this we will wait for everything to be ready to click on Reset. Chapter 7 Fix Error in Windows 11 File System To use this option, you can use Command Prompt or Terminal as an administrator. Look for the name in the search engine and on the side click on Run as Administrator. You must accept Windows permissions. First you're going to restore the local image of Windows 11, for this execute the command on the screen. Wait for the process to finish. When this command comes to an end you will be able to see whether or not errors were detected in the system image. Now it is time to analyze the file system of the system. This is achieved with the command that is executed on the screen. Then, we can see the results of the analysis, and thus determine if there is something that generates the error of the file system. Chapter 8, Scan Hard Drive Windows, 11. Chapter 9, Repair Windows, 11 Startup. Right-click on the Start menu and in the list click on Terminal as Administrator. Confirm System Permissions. You are going to run the on-screen command to scan the hard drive. You will need to enter the letter E to confirm this step. After this, restart Windows so that the computer diagnostic runs. It will automatically restart after this.
Chapter 9, Repair Windows 11 Startup You will click on the Start menu and then on the Windows Shutdown button. You're going to press the Shift key on your keyboard and then click Restart. This will cause Windows to be restarted in advanced mode. In this section you will click on Troubleshoot, then you will click on Advanced Options. After this click on Startup Repair. The system will be scanned. In case we do not see any solution, we click on Advanced Options. Then you need to click Continue to Restart Windows 11. We hope it has been helpful for you. Here are links to watch more videos of your interest and subscribe to the Solvetic channel. Thank you.